What's up you guys and welcome back. I have a smallish Sephora haul to share with you guys. I didn't pick up a ton of stuff, but I have enough and I'm super excited to share it with you all, show you what I got. Everything is brand new and I haven't tried it before. Stay tuned if you wanna see. As always, everything will be linked down in the description box for easy shopping if you want to shop or check out any of the items that I shared today. But let's go ahead, dive right in and get started. This is the largest thing in the box, so let's just start with this. Um, I have never tried anything from Summer Friday, so I'm really looking forward to finally getting my hands on some of the products and trying them out. I saw this little holiday gift set uh, and thought it was just the cutest thing and thought also it was like a really good value too. So I picked up their Lip Butter Balm set and it comes with a full size of their original Lip Butter Balm, the one that's like gone viral. And then you get three minis of the three other colors and it was $40. For me, I thought this would be perfect because quite honestly, um, the three other ones that are tinted, I am not sure how often I will use them and graph for them, but I did really wanna try them. So I thought just starting out with a little mini version of these would be good. And then having a full size of like the original that is I think clear <laughs> would be best. Here's what it looks like. So cute. Love the packaging. Um, so this one, I wonder if it smells. I, I genuinely don't know if these have a scent. Oh, I think it does, like a little vanilla. Oh my God. It's clear. Just wanna see what the texture is like. I'm not gonna put it on over my lipstick, but oh, it feels nice. It has like a little vanilla scent to it. Cool. I keep seeing people using this one all over TikTok with like just a lip liner and then this and it looks so gorge. Um, but it's just kind of like a nudie brown. So this one's called Vanilla Beige. What is this one called? Oh, just vanilla. This is the darkest, I think. This one is brown sugar. Ooh, she could be fun. Oh my god, they all smell really, really nice. This one is more of like um, a purple undertone. Kind of like going with my nails, which I just got done, by the way. Aren't they cute? It's like a little... You can't see it. Shit. <laughs> oh my god. I have no coordination. It's like a little coffee manicure. I love it. Okay, and then let's try this last one. This one's poppy. It's like coral shade. Oh yeah, that one's definitely brighter. So cute. I'm excited to have this set. I'll let you guys know how I like them um, when I officially like put them on, wear them. They're like sticky or anything like that, but it doesn't feel like it first impression on my hand, so. Okay, next is a Rare Beauty product that I've been dying to get my hands on and it's either been sold out or I just like, I don't know what it is. I put it in my car and then I just save it for later and I've done that so many times, but I finally grabbed it. Um, it's the Positive Light Illuminator in Mesmerize. And one of the reasons I wanted this so badly is I love when I see people mixing this and the Rare Beauty like liquid blushes together. It always looks so stunning. Um, and so I've been wanting to do that and finally grab this. So, uh, I think I already said I got the shade Mesmerize. It's um, kind of in the pinky tone family, but I love that it still has this doe foot applicator. I feel like you get a lot of product. I just, I love their packaging so much. And I mean, this in the bottle alone looks so pretty. So let's, oh my God, I feel like I just wasted so much. Oh, it's so gorge. Okay, I put it on this part of my hand here. Can you all see? Super, super pretty. I imagine you can build this up too. Like I really tapped it out. Oh, but it feels nice too. So I'm excited to use this. Okay, and then <laughs> another Rare Beauty find, but I saw this little set and I immediately added it to cart. I thought it was so cute and I've been wanting to try the Happy Blush for 
the longest time it's always sold out but um it came with a little mini in this set and i was like you know what i i'll take the mini over not having it at all so it's um one of their little holiday sets that they came out with uh here's a close up of it you get three of their blushes which their blushes are amazing um i will say so the one that comes in this and is a full size it's in the shade encourage i believe um i do have that um already but i love it so i was like i'll take another full size i don't care and then you get happy and truth and the little mini so let's open it up oh my god the minis are cute so this is full size and this is the shade encourage and i feel like it might look a little intimidating because it might look like it's darker but it's actually super super pretty i'll just show you guys um if you've tried their blushes you know you literally need the smallest dot ever uh but i'll just blend this out like it has so much pigment in product uh, but it's actually super super gorgeous this color and it's really pretty for fall and i've been using it lately so we have another one of these oh my god look how freaking adorable here are the minis i don't know why i can't get a grip on this they're so cute so tiny this one is happy the super bright pink blush that i feel like is all over tiktok and this one is truth which this one kind of looks yeah even darker than encouraged so let's do a quick little baby swatch of them the topa is literally precious i cannot deal <gasps> shade oh my god dude another reason i was so okay with getting a um, mini like sizes like this too um is because of how pigmented these are i knew they would still last forever i did the tiniest dot of happy and it's right here um and it's just like a super bright pretty pink and i cannot wait to slather that all over <laughs> my cheeks let's try truth Ooh, she looks vampy where i'm running out of room i need to i guess wipe my hand off <gasps> Okay, so that is it before I blend it out. But let me show you what it looks like blended. Ooh, pretty. This could be fun for like the holidays, a Christmas party. That's it right there. Super stunning. I have yet to meet a rare beauty blush that I haven't loved. Another item I'm so excited for and has sat in my cart for the longest time. I usually hit like move to save or, or save for later <laughs> or move to loves. Uh, but I finally, finally decided to grab it. Oh, the packaging is twisted. Um, I immediately opened this as soon as I got it in and tried it out and chef's kiss but let me tell you what it is it's the way perfume and it's the north bondi scent which this smells like so many of their hair products their hair mask that i love a lot of their texturizing sprays dry shampoo hairsprays um this smells like that they make some of the best smelling hair products i have ever come across um, and the fact that they actually put this in a perfume is amazing because I cannot tell you guys how many times I will try something like that, like a hair product, and I love the scent of it. I'm like, oh, I wish they would make this into a perfume. And I said that with Way initially when I had tried their products out, and they did it. Um, this is not new by any means. It's just new to me. So I love the packaging. I love that it's round. I think it's so cute. I just love the way it looks. I love that it's like a light little purple tint to it as well. And the top is one of my favorite things if I can get it off because it's magnetic and I just absolutely love that about it. Um, but anyways, this was $60. It smells so good. I spritzed this on me last night and wore it out to dinner and I could smell it the entire time. Um, I need to spray it now. I just, I feel like I do. Mm. Oh, it just, it smells so good. I don't 
don't even know like what it has notes of. I feel like I need to check. Okay, so I just pulled it up on Sephora to like get the actual note details of this. So it says the scent type is fresh florals and the key notes of this are Italian lemon, jasmine, and bergamot, which makes total sense why I love this so much because those are some of my favorite scents. Um, but it says this beautiful floral fragrance contains notes of bergamot, Italian lemon, rose de mai, hmm, violet, and white musk. And the North Bondi fragrance is also found in Way conditioners, their wave spray, their volume spray, the leave-in conditioner, air dry foam, texturizing hairspray, Dry, dry texture foam, soft mousse, their dry shampoo, and the dry shampoo foam. So, and I use a ton of those products. Um, so yeah, this is just like ugh, so good. I love, love, love this. Okay, and then I have two more products that I ordered from Sephora and they're gonna look so small and tiny, you guys. Um, but everybody says these are super pigmented and not to worry about the size because they will last forever um but i've been dying to try out milk makeup and i actually had the saddest story happen uh with this um matte bronzing stick because i literally bought this in store um i was able to find the receipt even showing that i paid for this i got home and checked the bag like a few days later um this was months ago by the way and it wasn't in there so technically i bought this before uh, but i don't know what happened i don't know if the sales associate like forgot to put it in the bag or something i feel like that's had to be what happened um but anyway paid for it never got it and so i finally was like all right i'm just gonna pay for it again because obviously i really wanted it so i got the milk bronzing stick and baked and then i wanted to try out their blush too i've seen so many people use this and it looks gorgeous so this is the lip and cheek stick in perk um again they look so small and tiny but apparently they pack a lot of pigment and they last a super long time but look how small <laughs> it's just a baby <laughs> um the color looks stunning though and it was funny because i'm not even kidding two days after i placed this order and paid for the milk products this is the blush look at that color uh they actually reached out to me via dm on my instagram um and asked for my address because they wanted to send pro oops they wanted to send products over so i'm really excited i don't know what they're going to be sending but maybe more of these i don't know um i'll obviously share once i get that packaging because i'm very excited for it but look how cute and tiny we'll swatch this Oh, it's definitely like creamier than I was thinking. I'm sure it'll build up though, but that's it right here. It's definitely like a pretty pinky peach color. Very up my alley. I love, love, love tones like this um, for like my blush and my lips. So I'm excited to try it out on both. By the way, I got that shade Poppy, the Summer Fridays lip all over my pants when I wasn't paying attention. So love that for me. Here is the bronzing stick. It just looks like a beautiful like brown shade, really the perfect tone. Oh my God, I love the formula of this. I can tell already. Um, I do feel like the blush formula and this formula is a little bit different. Like this is super, super beautiful. So I cannot wait to actually use it as a um, bronzer. Uh, but I'm hoping that the cheek color won't be too sheer. So we'll see, but all right, you guys, well, that is going to wrap up and conclude today's video. So I hope you guys enjoyed seeing a Sephora haul, but I love you guys so, so much. Let me know what you want to see next. Let me know if you want to see a haul, more beauty, some tutorials. I haven't done that in a while. Um, I love hearing from you all and knowing what you want to see from me, but as always, thank you so, so much for tuning back in and watching. Love you all so much. And until next time. Keep your sweet concussion